Hi and welcome to my review on Saijin Mod 10 for the Dell Streak 7. I apologize if I say that name wrong, but that's just how I say it. So you can see I got my Dell Streak 7 here. I've got the charging light going. And I'm just going to press power here. And if it decides to come up here, maybe I'm not pressing it long enough, that happens. Oh, there it goes. So it's starting up with the Dell logo here. keyboard here while it's booting. As you can see the side mod and logo is booting. Sorry I got a little bit of a glare there. As you can see that was really quick boot. That's one thing I really like about this build I've made. So we go ahead and uh, unlock it. I'll hold it up like this maybe that'll do a bit better. And you got your screen here and menu touch and you can see the Capacitive buttons work just fine. Uh, you can't see that down at the bottom there, how the menu's working. You have the back arrow. Now, one thing that doesn't work is my volumes because I'm still working on the audio. This thing is just driving me nuts with getting the, the audio howl to work. But, so there you go. And you go menu, you can see I got store, the settings to work. Wi Fi will come on. As you can see, it's discovering some uh, Wi-Fi SSIDs. I'll turn that off. Now, Bluetooth, it says it comes on. I really haven't tested it, so I can't really guarantee you that it works or not. I'll just hit the back arrow, and then we have all the different side of mod settings. Then we have display, and I can show you that uh, brightness does work. The sliding control does make it brighter and darker, so that's good. The automated backlight, I really don't know if that works. It probably won't work until I get the sensors down. Storage, I've got the two gigabytes of data storage. Internal storage, I'm still working on that. And as you can see, I've also got the external storage the SD card fixed. Apps. Works fine. Installs the apps just fine. I've got ES File Explorer there. Profiles, which probably won't work with sound. Now, GPS says it's up and working. Again, I haven't really tested it out to know if it was working or not. And date and time, I can fix that if I wanted to, but I flash so often I just don't. And performance options. I really don't. I think we disabled the uh, overclocking here, really. But I should have uh, a bunch of different uh, governors there. Different status of the information. Dell Streak 7. Currently, this is on build uh, Android 4.1.2. And this will be released out to people as soon as I get that storage and sound knocked out. So this was actually built by me this morning. So it's 4.1.2. And as you can see, it's pretty smooth. I mean, that's that project butter, but I mean, it's pretty fast, pretty smooth. I mean, this is the Dell Streak 7, which is a Tegra 2, and it's still pretty darn quick and smooth for a, uh, you know, almost three-year-old device that Dell decided that, hey, let's not do it anymore, but that's all right. I will finish off where Dell is uh, setting, eh, not worth the while. So as you can see, I'm uh, doing the different brightness adjustments. So that works just fine. And G like I said, GPS says it turns on. I don't know if it really does, but so I like it. And it's one of just my little side projects. So that's kind of my review on the Dell Streak 7. I hope you uh, get to see my Saijin Mod 10 fully uh, beta version soon, as soon as I get sound and storage down. Thank you so much.